Hey, what's going on everybody? Echo Side Fiend here back once again and uh, today I got an unboxing to do. This just came, I just went and picked this up from my mailbox. Uh, I got the notification that it was there and pretty much headed over there. So uh, yeah, as far as uh, today, it's a Wednesday. I'm just sitting around enjoying my last day of vacation before I got to go back to work. I've been on vacation for a week and a half. I got to go back to work tomorrow. Kind of wish I had just taken Thursday and Friday off too and had a two week vacation, but whatever. Uh, so I just have to work tomorrow and Friday and then I'm back to the weekend and then the following week I'm back to my regular schedule. So obviously had the time off for Fright Fest, Hollow Wicked. Obviously didn't actually go to Detroit for it, uh, for reasons that obviously everybody's aware of. Um, so, uh, over the weekend, uh, I'm sorry, over uh, last week, my roommate and I, uh, went up to Traverse City, uh, for a couple days. Uh, she, she had taken a few days of vacation as well. Uh, so we went up there, you know, make some use out of our vacation, because I already had it scheduled, I wasn't going to cancel it. So, uh, went up to Traverse City, hit some breweries, uh, went to the, the asylum, uh, the, the Grand Traverse Village and all that. And, um, yeah, just hit a few breweries, drove out on the peninsula, just, you know, had some fun. So, while I was up there, I did notice I had a headlight out, so I swung by a mire, grabbed a headlight bulb, put it in, didn't work. So I hit up my buddy, Rob, who's a, a car guy. Uh, brought it over to him when uh, we got back. He, he checked the wiring. Uh, there was no power going to the wires. So he's like, I bet it's the fuses. So he checked the fuses. Wasn't the fuses. So he's running a few more tests. Uh, decided if he were to dig deeper, he's going to have to take a whole bunch of stuff apart. He didn't feel comfortable doing that. So hit up my friend that owns a shop. Brought my car to him Monday night. They checked it Tuesday. Hit me up. They're like, you're looking at a pretty pricey uh, fix here. <laughs> so turned out it was a problem with the computer. Uh, so, uh, gonna set me back about a grand and he's hooking me up too. So, uh, but I have the money to do it. So and I'm like, yeah, just go ahead and do it. So they had to order the part and they're working on it today. So I don't have my car. Uh, so when I got this notification, uh, if you can see here, it is 71 degrees here in Grand Rapids. So I just walked over to my, uh, mailbox, grabbed, grabbed the mail and, um, and, uh, now I'm back with this and we're going to open this up. So this is, uh, the cadaver uh, you know, pre-order that I feel should have been here Thursday or Friday, but whatever it is, what it is. Uh, but at the time I ordered this, I also pre-ordered Alazulilu's Mausoleum, which I already got. I pre-ordered this, obviously, and I ordered an Axe uh, you know, t-shirt, AXE t-shirt, uh, which didn't come with my pre-order for Zul, and you can clearly see it's not in here uh, either, so... Um, I also had my order for the uh, Welcome to the Freak Show come. Uh, it wasn't in there, which I wasn't expecting. It. That just I think those were probably already pre-boxed up and just sent out for whatever you ordered. Um, so I am going to have to contact them. I'll probably do that just after I open this. So, But uh, I am pretty excited to check this out, so let's uh, go ahead and pop this open. So, um, Yeah, so my, uh, my uh, mailboxes are across the uh, apartment complex they used to be and they still all the boxes are still there but yeah, I'll just cut this over like this um, the boxes are all still there but they used to be in our foyer so they would just bring them there and then just a little while back they centralized everything and moved them um, across uh, to like you know the several buildings are all in one spot so you have to go and um, uh, you know, go drive over there or whatever. So I just uh, walked over there and checked it out. So now it is showing here. Uh, I wonder what this is. Um, so it's, they have things scratched out that it looks like they think they've already sent me. So they've got the Alazul Elu scratched out and my shirt scratched out uh, with no note saying anything about it. So I th it looks like they think they sent that to me already. So um, again, not a huge deal. I know I'll get it, but it's just, you know, they, they charged me for it. So I want to make sure I got it. So, and, uh, I forgot to bring my knife over here. So I'm just going to see if I can pop this open with my scissors here. And, um, I don't know how well this is going to work. So bear with me for a second here. There it goes. Um, so, uh, I'm going to have to, uh, hit them up. I, I've had other instances of, uh, ordering things that I didn't get uh, with m &E as well. They always fixed it, but they need to, uh, be a little more careful over there, so. But, uh, I have listened to this already, so like I said, it wasn't a huge deal that I didn't come here, but I pre-ordered it. I feel like if you pre-order, it should be here the day of or sooner, so. All right, so there it is. Blaze's Cadaver. Like I said, I have listened to this. I think it's pretty good. There are a few, uh, tracks that are kind of skippable, and I've said that before in a video, I think just the other day. 
uh, where I said a lot of Blaze's stuff does kind of, uh, like, I'll, I'll throw the album in and, like, three quarters of it is awesome, and uh, about a quarter of it I'm kind of like, eh, I could, you know, listen to or not listen to. So uh, that's usually how most of his stuff is. But, uh, you know, most of the time, I like, you know, I've always enjoyed everything he's put out. So, and there's the back track list. Sorry, trying not to get too much reflection in there. So, all right, let's pop this open and see what it looks like. So, not a whole lot to this. Wow, this is literally just uh, one little slip uh, sleeve, whatever you say. So, yep, just a thing on the back. It's a pretty cool picture, though. But, yeah, not not anything to that at all. That's actually kind of surprising. So, and we'll pop the CD off there. So, there is the CD. And then credits are right behind it. So, yeah, not a whole lot to that, but... That's kind of surprising, but whatever. So, but yeah, uh, definitely a, a good album. I, I definitely recommend it. I'm not going to say it's his best album he's ever put out, but it's definitely good. If you're a fan of him, I think you'll enjoy it. So, and that's all I got there. And uh, yeah, I'll probably uh, go ahead and hit MNE up, uh, hit up their customer service and find out where my fucking t-shirt is. I want my fucking t-shirt. I'm just kidding. I Obviously, it was just an oversight. I, I'm not worried about it. I know I'll get it. Or or they'll, you know, uh, supply something else instead if, if for some reason that's, not available anymore so um but yeah i'll probably go ahead and do that right now so uh but yeah that's the only thing i had for this time so as always thank you so much for watching thank you for supporting this is echo side fiend and i will catch you in the next one too sweet